I was out west skiing with my husband and two very dear friends. We were very excited to ski in Vail. The doctors came back into the room and said something about, you know, we see lesions in your brain, lungs, and liver. And I thought, you must have the wrong scans. But it, you know, I was, I had stage four melanoma, they determined, and I was back on a plane to New York City that day. When I met Meline, she already had melanoma that was very far advanced, involving her brain, her lungs, and her liver. And because of the extent of disease in the brain, there was concern about hemorrhage and seizures. I had two craniotomies, two gamma knife surgery procedures, and then a glioma removed. At New York Presbyterian Columbia, we're really blessed by having incredible scientific and clinical expertise across a range of different disciplines. So it's, it's really that team effort that gives us something very special here. It's exciting that there are so many clinical trials. The timing was very fortunate to be eligible for those immunotherapy drugs, and uh, I just feel very grateful. These drugs saved my life. What we're looking at here are, are Meline's lungs. This is the right lung, the left lung, and the heart. Um, and this one spot here um, is a spot that we know was melanoma. It was actually bigger about two years ago when we were actively treating her. It's just been slowly, slowly shrinking. And in fact, despite the fact that there's some lesions that we might see on the scans, I don't know that there's any live cancer there anymore. It's absolutely remarkable. Amazingly, I've always felt optimistic. I will get through this. Even though if you, if you, if you think about it abstractly, it's so grim and so I'm forgetful. Who cares? All my middle-aged friends are forgetful. Right? It is, I write everything down. I'm glad that I have options. So when I started treating melanoma 10 years ago, if we saw a patient like Meline, we never talked about cure. Um, and with these new drugs here, even with patients with melanoma affecting the brain, the goal is cure. It's, just, <laughs> it's, it's, it's amazing, right? This was a fatal disease, right, 10 years ago. And the fact is now we're curing, um, we think 40% of patients which we were not able to do 10 years ago. Not just meaningfully impact their quality of life, but actually take care of the disease and cure it all together. So in Meline's case, I think the prognosis in terms of the melanoma is outstanding. I don't think the melanoma is gonna be a problem again. I have four children and I feel very lucky to still be in the game and um, still be involved in their lives.